Hey guys, it's Ta. Welcome back. So today I have for you guys a haul from the Dollar Tree. It's not big at all. Um, just a few things that I had gotten and I forgot that I got them, but they're out of the car now. So I needed some more of the two and a half gallon bags. I absolutely love these for crafting stuff, for um games like when you take them out of the box and it's just not a good box to put them back in put them in here whenever abby has like play-doh and stuff set it all up and then it really helped out whenever they were working on my husband's car because all the pieces that they needed for like a specific thing could go into there and it was big enough so and then the main reason i had went was peanuts for the squirrels, I already gave them a bag. This is the second bag. And then I picked up a couple items that were Halloween clearance. Nothing major. Just these uh, DIY sticker hats. And then I did some bling. The purple bling with the pumpkins. Or jack-o'-lanterns. And then one set of these eyeballs. And that was all the Halloween I got and then I picked up this cup because I just thought it was so cute it says Merry and bright and it's you can kind of see it and it does have the top on it so I picked that up not that I needed new cups but that one just kind of stuck out to me you know and then a pack of the chalkboard circle name tags or chalkboard tags comes six to a pack and I got this new toothpaste I don't know like if it's new new or just new to me um I don't remember seeing this one it's the Colgate ultra white with charcoal so I want to give that one a try I do like charcoal toothpaste and Abby likes it too so um my tubes run out faster. So I want to try that one and see. I still have a lot of toothpaste left, but I don't have a lot of charcoal toothpaste left. Um, then I saw this. I bought it, but now I'm thinking, like, why did I need it? I don't know. It's the Crafter Square Roller Cutter. So I, I guess I'll figure something out with that. And then the only thing left in the bag is some treats for the dog two bags of those and then four more things and that's it for the dollar tree so i decided since they had a lot of their christmas bags and stuff out i wanted to get these these are humongous and i don't even know if i'm going to give big a gift big enough for this but just in case like look how big this bag is it's humongous um it does not have a size on it but it has this penguin print merry joy christmas ho 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 happy noel and then on the side are these trees and i figured i wanted one of each so i didn't want one kind to run out before i can get all of them so i just got all of them and then I got this one. It says, Believe in the Magic of Christmas. And then on the side, it's like blue, bluish green with snowflakes. It's almost Tiffany blue, I guess. Oops, I gotta pick that up. And then this one, it says, Wishing you a season filled with joy and then like peppermint stripes and you know now that I'm thinking about it I might just take the gifts for the kids no matter how big they are like how small they are um, especially if they have multiple and maybe just one bag per kid I need one more bag though because my sister's three Plus my niece and then well Abby's ones 
I'll probably just put Abby's like spread out under the tree, but there's, I can contain them in these bags and just bring one big bag to each kid. And then best wishes for a Merry Christmas. I just love that dark blue against the green and the red. I don't know. It looks really cool. And then it's just a red polka dot on the side. So that's everything from Dollar Tree. Like I told y'all, it was not a lot. I mainly needed the peanuts. And then I saw the bags and I just had to have them. So since you're already here, let me show you with this. Um, today I went to Ollie's. And I did... A lot better than I thought it would because y'all know it's so easy to just buy everything but I only bought like four things two of them are repeats one was a book it's in there some kind of novel I don't know I don't remember it looked interesting so I grabbed it not that I need any more books but hey I might need it for that one time I need to read it right so I picked up this Harry Potter thing it says J.K. Rowling's Wizarding World Harry Potter Winter at Hogwarts. Their price, $15.99. Our price, $2.99. So, of course, I picked it up. This little box. It's not super thick. Um, and it does open up. I just haven't opened this one yet. I'll just go ahead and open it so y'all can see. I opened Abby's already. Because I bought me one. I, I was like, ooh, let me get one. And I was like... You know what? Let me get her one too. Because if I don't, I'm going to lose mine. Okay, so you open it up and then you have the Hogwarts crest. And then inside you have this little thing of string. You have this. It's like a wooden piece. And it's the pieces of a broomstick. And then there's this. It is the, um, it tells you to use color pencils and markers to color. Then you have right here. Think about how you would like to customize your 3D fireboat broom model. Do you want to make it look like a fireboat in the films or do you want to do something different? Read the instructions before putting it together so it looks like you put it together and then you tie a piece of the string so that you can make it float and then also inside there are gift tags and on the front it has um, either the full crest or Slytherin there's Ravenclaw um, I think there's Gryffindor tags yeah they have one for each one and then they have some that just say to and from with the different elements from the movie. So I thought that was cool. Let's see how many gift tags you get. 48 colorable gift tags with strings. So you also use your string for your gift tag. So 48 of them. And then you get the 3D Firebolt. And then you get this little 48 page coloring book. And it says Harry Potter Winter at Hogwarts. And basically it's any scene during the movies that happen during winter and they have it all let's see at the ball Hermione and then it's a lot of Christmas trees and stuff and then you can see where Harry got his first sweater from the Weasleys And then, come on, you can do it. Yeah, it has like different scenes from the movies, different, um, and in the back, of Abby thought it was really neat. It has the crest for each one individually, and you can color them. She's a Hufflepuff, so she's going to do that. And they even have it on the back, where you can color the back page. So that's everything that was in there for $2.99, definitely. $15.99, mm. No, I don't think so. And the other thing I wanted to show you is this book. It says their price, $24.99. And I kind of believe it. 
Um, our price, $3.99. It is a Disney Ideas book. And it's over 100 ideas for Disney crafts, activities, and games. So I was kind of looking through it earlier, just a little flipperoo. Like when I saw it at the store, I just picked it up immediately and put it in my cart. Voila, I didn't have a cart today. I used my hands because I only got a few things. Um, I, was, I didn't even look at it. I just knew it was going to be a great book, and it was. So it has um, where you can play. It shows you how to set up games. And then right here, for instance, this would have worked out for somebody for Halloween to turn a pumpkin into a pumpkin coach, which I did a trick-or-treating basket like pumpkin just like this for Abby and I even used wire I made the ribbon like made the um the wheels and stuff oh yeah went all out on it let's see what else is in here and then you can make playing card costumes for Alice in Wonderland the Queen of Hearts um these party bags Abby thought were really neat and it's Toy Story, and it shows you how to make them, how to draw everything out. So, yeah, there's lots of cool ideas in here. Like, it even shows you how to make a piggy bank, like Mr. Ham. Um, pixie dust lip gloss. Like, what? So, definitely pretty cool. Make some sculptures. So I figured this book right here for $3.99 can definitely bring hours worth of fun, whether it be um, just preparing to play some type of game or making a craft together. I figured we can do that together. But also I can do it by myself too because these look like a lot of fun. Like I cannot wait. I'll probably, I might even try to make something tomorrow and I'll show you guys whatever it is. I just got to go around and see what... Um, what I'm going to make and if I have all the supplies for it. Because tomorrow I'm going to do my best and stay home. Because I do have to catch up on some um, housework. So I'm going to probably do that tomorrow. Some Get caught up on laundry. Uh, actually just a batch just finished before I started talking to you guys. I was like, oh man the dryer's going to be so loud. And then it went, ah, and I'm like, oh it's done. It's fine. So, Yay. Uh, also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but in the last 24 hours, we have definitely picked up some new folks. So, I should have said this first, but welcome to all new subscribers. We are happy you are here. Um, make sure you enter the giveaways that are going on, which is for the Earfleek gift card. Um, I'll link that down below. And I do have a crafting challenge going on that it will be linked down below as well. Um... What else? Also, every last Friday of the month, I do a $5 giveaway just because it's the last Friday of the month. And in order for you guys to enter into that, you just have to send me one time, just send me a three by five index card with all of your information that you would like to provide, your name, address, uh, if you have a channel, what is it, any socials you wanna put on there, birthday. And um, you'll automatically, every month, be put in over and over again and if you win two months in a row you win two months in a row so if you want to do that send the you can either do a memory decks or a three by five index card to the p.o box below um so yeah i will let you guys go with that hope you had a wonderful day and i will see y'all tomorrow hopefully with a craft out of this amazing disney book i'm so excited Bye, y'all.